Hi, Dane again from Chaparral Shooting Sports. In this video, we're going to go over the basic gear that you're going to need to do a running gun. Um, the main keys are is your, your rifle. Uh, most everybody uses an AR-15, although some people will use something different. This one is mine that I used in both Pecos and the Waco events. Um, for pistol, really almost any pistol will do. Uh, I run a SIG 226. I have a two-piece gun belt with the extra magazines and my first aid kit and a holster. One of the important things is that you have a holster that has both some form of retention and completely covers the trigger of your pistol. Uh, to carry my magazines and everything else, I use this Viking Tactics uh, chest rig. It'll hold four 30 round magazines. Plus I have a, uh, I carry a multi-tool just in case to try to fix anything. And I have a pouch to hold my cell phone as well. For hydration, I use a Camelback, which seems to be about the best solution for it. And then for ear protections, I use these electronic earmuffs, which work a lot better because it allows you to hear the range officer without having to mess with taking earplugs out or taking your earmuffs off and on. I also personally like to use gloves on all my runs just because my rifle gets a little bit hot and my hands sweat and it lets me grip my pistol a little bit better. So a lot of people have also asked me, you know, they don't have all the fancy gear and everything ready for a running gun. And what is sort of the minimum amount of gear that you need to run one of these events? Well, this is about a basic of a setup as you really need to actually finish the event. Uh, any sort of rifle will do. Uh, this is just a basic AR-15 with iron sights. It'll be a little bit more of a challenge uh, for some of the distance targets, but theoretically you should be able to hit them. I mean, the Army and the Marine Corps does, so if you're a good shot, it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, again, the important thing is a holster that has some form of retention and will completely cover the trigger. And then just take your magazines, both your pistol, your rifle, your water, your basic foam earplugs, and you can just put it in a backpack and run the event. Now, you're probably not going to be the fastest with this sort of setup, because it's gonna take you a while should you have to do a magazine change. But as you go up to a stage, you can take uh, an extra rifle magazine and put it in your back pocket or put some in a, if you have a set of cargo pants, you can carry a few mags in your cargo pants as well. But this is basically it. You really don't need a ton of fancy gear to, to get started.